Hi, Valder. How are you? Good morning, Dalvet. Thank you so much for joining us on the Valder Beauty Show. Thank you for having me. Well, we're live in Dallas, Texas, you know, and we've got great weather here, Dalvet, but you know we're known for our walking trails where we, we even have a lot of pet parks, and I know you're here to talk about obesity and pets. I am. You know, having great success with Biggest Loser and helping out families change their lives, I realized that there was a family member that was overlooked, and that's our furry friends here. I partnered with Banfield Pet Hospital to see to it that the, they, uh, our animals get the proper attention that they've been neglected. That's true. You know, I think we love our pets so much, we're overfeeding them, probably not walking them enough because we're not exercising enough, we're probably not exercising them. It, it affects everyone. The lack of activity, the lack of proper lifestyle affects humans. I mean, it's, it's something that is extremely high. Um, over the last five years, our pets' uh, obese rate overweight has increased tremendously so it's something we have to take care of and uh, pay attention to since you've partnered with i think you told me banfield banfield pet hospital absolutely exactly what tips can they give us to make uh this better i've come up with some great workout tips on banfield.com fitness uh go to that site see some cool exercises that you can do in the park things you can do um, on the go with your pet, you're staying active, your pet's staying active, and everybody's winning. I like that. Let me ask you, as we continue to move forward, and, and now that we know that this is a problem, you know, um, online, what, what, what kind of tips do you think we can find also? Um, I've come up with workouts that you can do uh, depending on the size of your dog. Um, everything from plyo box jumps to resistant bands, um, walking your dog on a leash, doing shuttle runs, using things like your, your tennis balls and having your cat fetch behind it and, you know, just keep moving and come up with fun and exciting ways to get you active as well as your pet. Well, Dovet, you know, we now seeing you on TV more and more. I think I saw you on a commercial. I've seen you on, as you mentioned, you know, uh, major, uh, I guess they're called reality shows. What's next for you? Um, I got a lot going on right now. I'm, I'm extremely busy. I'm currently filming the next season of Biggest Loser. I have a book coming out next season or well, uh, in the spring. Um, and I'm putting a lot of my focus right now with uh, guys like Finnegan here and making sure that they get healthy. I like that. Are you a pet owner also? Uh, yes, I, I was, but I'm no longer. But I'm falling in love with this guy, so I'm hoping by the end of this conversation I'm going to say yes again to that question. I love that. I really do. A pet is a great responsibility, but it's such a big reward. Delvet, I want to thank you so much for talking to us and reminding us that pets need to be healthy also, too. Give me that website one more time. That website is banfield.com slash fitness. Delvet Quest, I know we're going to see incredible things from you as you continue to uh, skyrocket in your career, but thank you for giving us something that can really help us in our own lives. I really appreciate it. Thank you, Valder. I'm saying bye, and so is Finnegan. Bye, Finnegan. Bye, Delvet.